we got here? Ooh, we got that burial. Burial brewing, they're good. We have a winter reporter with cocoa nibs and raspberries. It's meant to be served at 48 degrees, got 40 IBUs. I can remember where it says the percentage, seven. Seven percent. The ports are winnower, yes. That which we crave we seek endlessly, whether morning, noon, or night, our dreams are overrun with unearthly delights, our eyes wide, seeking an out-of-body experience lost in the depths of decadence. But we learn. The winnower peels back the layers of excess, uncovering the beauty of balance. Unlike white balancing and lighting balancing, which I'm not doing, blended among a backbone of well-kilned chocolate malts, our mild black porter rests upon 300 pounds of local French broad chocolates, cocoa nibs, and an immense amount of crushed raspberries. The indulgence in extreme luxury is a mortal sin, but who needs it anyways? So yeah, it sounds delicious. Uh, we'll see how it pours. With a one-hand cameraman. Can't really tilt the glass because, you know, I don't have three hands, so, uh... It helps to have it in your authentic Natty Greens Brewing Company glass, not sponsored. And my pour will be horrible because I couldn't hold it sideways, but we'll get back when the... So as you can see, or maybe not, because color balancing is not my strong suit, this is a caramel colored head. Well, once it settles down a bit, it's about, you know, one, two fingers width, I suppose. You can smell chocolate and raspberries, because uh, why wouldn't you? It has cocoa and raspberry in it. Hmm. Okay, strong raspberry on the intake. Strong raspberry, a little, little thin, a little weak. A little bit of bitterness in there. You can taste the chocolate. It's more dark chocolate than uh, milk. Uh, that's from the cocoa nibs, but yeah, tastes like raspberry and chocolate. It's pretty good. Uh, probably tastes a little bit better if it's warmed up. Maybe not room temperature, but a little under. It'd be pretty good. But uh, yeah, good art on all the burials cans. As usual. Usually double-sided as well, so it's like a ship. But yeah, it's good. Let's say, uh, I mean, you should probably drink it. It's good to try. If you ever make it down to Asheville South Slope, go to Burial. They usually have some different brews. I'm a big fan of their Skillet Donut Stout. But uh, yeah, I'd say on a scale of uh, 1 to 5, you should drink it. It's good. So uh, yeah, hope you liked it. See you on the next one.